Today I want to talk about soybean maturity ratings and what they actually mean in real life. There are many characteristics to think about when you're selecting a soybean variety. One of the most important is to find a maturity that's right for your farm. Soybean varieties are rated on a relative maturity scale and split into groups. In Western Canada, we typically grow varieties in the double zero or triple zero groups, double zero being later and triple zero being earlier. Within each group, varieties are rated from zero to nine, zero being the earliest and nine being the latest. So what do relative maturity in soybeans mean on your farm? For example, say you're used to growing a double zero point three relative maturity variety and you want to harvest your soybeans earlier. You should be looking at something earlier in the double zero maturity group at double zero point one or double zero point two or even into the triple zero maturity groups. For another example, say you're used to growing a double zero point five relative maturity and you're interested in a product at double zero point eight. It's important to keep in mind that that product at double zero point eight will be maturing a few days after the product you're used to at double zero point five and think about what that's going to mean for your operation during harvest. For more information on relative maturity in soybeans and elite soybeans from Brett Young, visit brettyoung.ca.